Hello and welcome to this short tutorial of how to utilize our pre-configured DCS SRS or Simple Radio Standalone utilizing the Odeka Spacecom Relay Service. With this pre-configured file, you will not have to enter any server information which will allow you to connect almost immediately with minimal configuration. This download can be found in our reference documents section on the Discord or in the description of this video. Simply download the file to your desktop, extract the contents of the zip folder, open the SR Tech Client Radio application, set your default microphone and speakers. Under controls, configure your push to talk. I'm utilizing mouse button 4, but in the controls it shows as F11. Don't worry, it's configured properly. Now going back to our general tab, the server information has been preloaded. Simply click connect, enter your call sign in the EAM name field, and select connect to external AWAX mode. And then select toggle AWAX overlay. Now you have the AWAX GCI panel. Under your first tab, you can select locations around the Stanton system. In this case, if we select Calliope, we get a frequency of 100.014. There are also emergency channels, which you can select in the same manner. But we're going to focus on this radio, radio number 4. Here you can type in any frequency you want. In this case, 123.450, strike enter, and then press the orange button to select this radio. We also have the option to select a encryption key. In this case, we'll select 42, enable. And now we see E42. That lets us know that encryption has been enabled. For radios 4 through 10, there are no preset channels. Now, if we press our push to talk button, we see the light go green and there is a chirp at the beginning of our transmission. And that's it. The simple radio standalone application is incredibly easy to use, but allows for complex communication between multiple teams without complex configuration or continuously jumping between various servers. Because the server is publicly hosted by Odeka, anyone can connect to it. But with millions of frequencies and encryption key combinations, you can be reasonably certain your communications are secure. We hope you have found this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions, please reach out to a care mining and reclamation, and we will see you in the verse.